Iona. Cruise Line. P&O Cruises. Guest Capacity. 6,600. Sister ship to Arvia, Iona is another magnificent ship from P&O Cruises that will remain one of the biggest British cruise ships for many years to come. Arvia and Iona are very similar. Iona sails throughout Europe, including the fjords, the Canary Islands, and to Spain and Portugal. Costa Toscana. Cruise Line. Costa Cruises. Guest Capacity. 6,554. Costa Toscana is a twin sister of Costa Smeralda, giving a very similar experience. The best in Italian and international cuisine, plenty of spaces to relax, and some fantastic facilities for the kids. In fact, her main difference is in the itineraries offered. While most are still in the Mediterranean, she also sails to the Middle East for cruises from Dubai. Costa Smeralda. Cruise Line. Costa Cruises. Guest Capacity. 6,554. The Costa Smeralda is the biggest ship in the Costa Cruises fleet, and she is built to the same template as Arvia. After all, Costa Cruises and P&O Cruises all fall under the umbrella of the Carnival Corporation. The ship still has 30 dining and drinking venues though 11 places to eat and 19 bars or lounges, so plenty of space to unwind. Arvia. Cruise Line. P&O Cruises. Guest Capacity. 6,685. Arvia is the newest cruise ship from P&O Cruises and arguably the ultimate flagship of British cruising. She's packed with things to see and do, including over 30 dining venues and bars, six theaters and lounges with live entertainment, and five swimming pools. MSC World Europa. Cruise Line. MSC Cruises. Guest Capacity. 6,762. A very modern ship, she was the first LNG-propelled ship for MSC Cruises and she is packed with other eco-friendly technologies too. MSC World Europa, as per her name, sails around Europe throughout the year, with departures from various Mediterranean ports. The Lure of the Seas. Cruise Line, Royal Caribbean. Guest Capacity, 6,780. Launching one year after her sister ship, Allure of the Seas was the second Oasis-class ship and at the time, she was marginally bigger. However, the 2019 revamp and expansion of Oasis of the Seas has dropped Allure by a single place. Oasis of the Seas. Cruise Line. Royal Caribbean. Guest Capacity. 6,771. The first Oasis-class ship to launch, it's a sign of just how groundbreaking she was that her debut was in 2009 and she remains within the top five largest cruise ships ever built, for now at least. Oasis of the Seas really caused waves, pun intended, with just how spectacular she was. Harmony of the Seas. Cruise Line. Royal Caribbean. Guest Capacity. 6,687. If you're noticing a theme to this list, then well done. The third Oasis-class ship to launch is also the third biggest ship sailing the waves in 2023. Harmony of the Seas is actually very slightly longer than Wonder of the Seas, but her overall interval volume is lower. Symphony of the Seas. Cruise Line. Royal Caribbean. Guest Capacity. 6,680. Symphony of the Seas is another Oasis-class ship, and she's very similar to Wonder of the Seas in terms of onboard entertainment, dining choices, and the iconic Central Park in the middle of the ship. Symphony of the Seas offers similar itineraries to Wonder of the Seas, but she is based out of Miami during the winter months in Barcelona in the summer. Wonder of the Seas. Cruise Line. Royal Caribbean. Guest Capacity. 6,988. Wonder of the Seas is the current biggest cruise ship in the world, and the most recent of the Oasis-class ships to have launched. She's an incredible ship packed with the very best that Royal Caribbean has to offer. There are eight distinct neighborhoods, including Central Park, a lush public space filled with live greenery, upscale dining options, and high-end shops. Thanks for watching this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.